Hey guys, Chris here, bringing you back episode 4 of my single player Let's Play series. So today, guys, I want to finish off this enchanted bookshelf little area. And the reason I didn't show this on camera is because I did, actually, but uh, my video got terminated, so I'm actually recording this right after. So, pretty sad about that. I mean, my head's low. <laughs> Look, and I'm sad. I'm sad, but it's alright. I mean, what are you going to do? It always happens to someone, and just my unlucky day, so... That's alright, so I built this, guys. I want to show a little in-depth of that. I did a couple of things on camera. I want to show all of that. So, guys, in here, just have some pumpkins, and you guys can just probably figure it out all yourselves. But we're going to be building this area today. So, um, guys, I want to show you some other things that I did on camera first. So, I'm also going to be filling in the cave. I don't want to see any of this back area because it looks kind of crap, so I kind of want to make it look like I dug into the wall. So, that's my goal. And we're going to be setting up the redstone and everything else. So, guys, I also built this. Um, this is just an extension of the road, which I haven't decided yet, but I think I'm going to go with that thing right there. I need to build this section again. Actually, let's count this. One, two, three, four, five, um, and seven. So, one, two, three, four, five. And it's going to be a little short, but that's all right. Okay. Well, I expanded this a bit, and, whoa, was that a hole? Almost fell down that. And I just extended a three wide here, which will lead into our bookshelf area. I also did some work around the cave spider grinder. I've improved it a lot. I did some work, and I've improved the rates a ton. I've used a new design, which I think is absolutely amazing. And it just uses some stairs and some signs. It makes a water tunnel so they can track me, but they can't defeat those water tunnels. So it's actually working out pretty good. Also, I did some enchants on camera. I got this bad boy, sharpness 4, looting 3, and this shovel. Not sure if I had this guy last episode. I didn't. I don't think so I did. But I had these three guys, and these guys are rolling good. I'm gonna die. I also did die with um, 30 levels, 10 diamonds, and another one of these guys. So pretty much a bummer. So I had to do some more shaft mining to get up to this, level, get up to this point. And this guy's running low, and I will show you in a second why. And another thing I did off camera, guys, is I dug out some slime chunks. I was hoping to get some slime spawnage, but um, I haven't been that lucky. Just put it that way. So here's the area of the cave spider grinder. And I think it looks pretty darn good. Gotta be honest with you guys. I think it turned out really good for me. And any slimes in here? Yes, yeah, so there's always an occasional slime. Um, let's kill this guy because we got looting on this sword. Um, so it's working out okay, but I think next episode we're going to do a slime farm, so hopefully you guys are going to be looking forward to that. And let's actually come back down here, uh, we can do this, yeah. So I definitely just want some slime balls, I'm tired of trying to get these slime balls, just want to get them over with, get the slime balls I need to build, and that's going to be nice. Alright, so we can place a guy there, it's alright. Alright, so we can... Put, I'm not sure how I'm going to enter this though, because it's kind of, oh, actually I'm going to enter it from right here, the ladder leads up there to an area, and so how this thing works is, these are the lights, I only have it connected, what do you, what do you, what do you think you're doing buddy, you're just going to die, so I'm going to show you guys the redstone really quickly, so first off, this is a light lever, it just goes all the way over here, pretty, pretty simple redstone, just goes into here to the light room, and I haven't set up the light, you just, what are you doing, you're going to die, okay? To tell your brothers not to come back, okay? I haven't set up the lights for this room yet, but I will do that soon enough. Okay, so over here, guys. Um, let me eat some food. Got some carrots, I think. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Oh, it's eat, eat, eat. Yum, 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 yum. So turn that thing on, and it'll turn the lights on in that room. As you guys can see, I don't want to go back over there. But this, I want to show you the redstone first. Actually, I'll show you this thing in action. So see these guys down here? They're climbing up. Hit this lever or hit this button, I should say, these guys get crushed. But with this T flip-flop here, the piston below will stay there. So I'll show you guys. Let me just kill these guys. Die! These, are, these guys are all going to die. There we go. There wasn't too many of them in there. But as you guys can see, this piston is still here. One flaw with this design, though, is I have to click... Whoops, wrong placement. Dumb guy, just placing it wrong. Just hit that again, and then this thing will come up, but this will retract so kind of a design flaw but i find it it doesn't really matter i just oh my lord oh my lord 
Stop spawning. What's the block light in here? Um, there's an eight, so maybe they can spawn in here. Not sure. Okay, but let's take a look at the redstone. Skip forward if you don't want to see this. So I'll start off over here. Pretty simple redstone leaning into here, just a repeater. I want this thing to extend before this does, just because of the fact that I rather have the floor be set for them, and then we can crush them. So that's why there's a four tick delay here. And this goes into the comparator crusher system. I uh, remove you. Oh. Darn it. Derp, derp, derp. No, give me that cabo. Give me that cabo. Uh, any more redstone? There we go. Perfect. Alright, so it leads into this comparator system. Redstone back there. And it goes into this. And this is a pretty valuable resource because it'll come back through to here. And we can keep crushing and just doing this thing. But it will not be able to contract all the way to over here and ruin that thing because of the repeater. Doesn't allow the signal to go back. So, very good repeater. It's a good guy, you know. And so what here is, is this a T-flip-flop. So it adds a one-tick pulse into this, and will either ex extend or retract this piston. So very cool design there. So everything's working out pretty good with this redstone so far. I haven't had any problems with it yet. But I want to show you the slime chunk. So I showed you one back over there. That was one slime chunk. And if I go over here, yep, there's a tunnel right here. Okay, sweet. So the case spider grinder is actually working out pretty good. I've gotten some level 30 enchants. Ooh. Almost fell down there to my death. Okay, so um, I believe we can go over here. Yeah. So I dug out two more slime chunks. I, I doubt there will be any slimes there, but uh, that one seems to be the most efficient along by the case fighter grinder. Uh, any guys in here? Do I hear anything? No. My sound. Oh, we can turn the sound up a little bit. There we go. All right, so down here is how we're going to be able to get to our other slime chunk. So this is the same chunk. This... Um, this one and the one below. So if I can just get down there and let's just jump down. Oh, there's a guy down. Oh, look at this. Look at this. It's just beautiful. It's working out great. Okay, let's get all these slime balls that we can get. Okay, so my pick took a big beating here, digging out all this area. It took a bit of a while. I mean, pretty boring stuff, so I didn't put it on camera. All right, so let's put this cobblestone back in here. So, I'm sorry if this is kind of like a world tour episode, just touring what I've done. But, um, I just, the stupid video, man, stupid video, it terminated on my face. So, it's like, I don't want to upload. My computer basically froze when I tried to, um, put the video and save it. And I was clicking save, you know, I was like, file save, and it was saving, and then the, and then the application didn't respond. So, I had to restart my computer. Kind of a bummer, but uh, it just happens to people, you know. So I can get over it pretty easily. Hopefully this episode will be pretty good. Last episode was about 32, 34 minutes long, so pretty decent episode. I was really happy with that final outcome, but everyone has problems. So kind of a bummer, kind of not, not quite sure. Can I sleep? Yeah, we can. All right, let's sleep, and then let's go back up, and maybe we can work on that redstone. Okay. Actually, let's actually get 30 levels, and I'll do a little iron pick enchantment. Crush and die. So this is where I'm storing my string at in here. Got a lot, and I don't have that many spider eyes. Uh, yeah. Okay. And I'm just storing some miscellaneous in here. Uh, nothing. I can, I can take those torches actually. So one problem. Oh, they're actually one hit. Yeah, I thought I had more than that. Whatever. Just grab those. Uh, I haven't thought of a solution though for like getting the drops. Maybe I'll have a piston um, right here, and then I can go down. Like, this piston will retract, and I can just go down and get the drops. Oh, no! No! Oh, no! Um, stone slabs, get in my inventory. Yes. No! <laughs> I'm poisoned. Eat, eat, eat. Alright, come on. Oh, I only need one more level. Come on. Come on. Someone, come on. Is there, are they getting stuck or something? Uh, they shouldn't be. No, they seem like they're going. Uh, it's a pretty slow race, though. Give me those levels. Yeah, 30, okay. We'll do a level 30 enchantment. Like about... Okay, let's go back. Let's go head back up to our little temp house desert village place. And another thing I want to talk about, guys, is I've been working a little bit on mine leak. Mostly on here, though, to be honest. I like to just do my schedule. I like to do it so... Uh, I usually take... I used to do a uh, video every other day, but I have not had the ability to do that during school. So, kind of a bummer, so can't do that, but that's alright. So, another thing is I like to do 
if I'm uploading a video, if I just uploaded a mining link video, once that video is uploaded, I am going to work really hard on my single player world until that video is uploaded. I don't like switching off. I will switch off every now and then just because I might get bored or something, but I like to main focus on what video I need to get out. So that's kind of my main priority for things. And I'm also going to turn the corner here. Maybe we can work on this a bit too. So kind of a bummer that it did that, but what are you going to do? 24 slime. Oh my god, I'm starting to gain some slime balls. So we're going to need some pistons so we can make some of those. And I needed to cook up some iron. I need to remind myself to do that, but... I forgot, like a dummy. I'm a dummy, I'm a dummy. I know, I know, I know. Okay, so let's go head back over here. And the cow and pig situation has been pretty minimal so far. I actually, actually could kill some of these pigs. Should we? I think we should breed them. Should we do it? Let's, let's do it. Ah. Okay. So there's going to be too many to handle once I breed all these guys. I'm going to use all these carrots up. Breed, 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 breed. There we go. Let's get out of here before I just look at all those pigs. It's amazing. Now what are we going to eat? I'm so smart, you know. Just give them my food source up for those piggies. Alright, so maybe we can cook up some beef. And I can show you where I've been shaft mining. So, as I said earlier, guys, I died with my 10 diamonds, which was very sad. And 30 levels in my pick. And here's a little temporary pumpkin farm. Just break all the grass. Ugh, I thrilled because I don't want those. Okay. Well, as I said, uh, that happened kind of a bummer, but, as I said, I mean, it's got to happen. Nothing can be perfect. So, in this building right here, uh, this one right there, doo -doo -doo -doo, that one, that's where I've been shaft mining. Well, I've been, I'm not in the building, I, I went below. Alright. Also, off camera, I found another dungeon, so let's check out what we got. So, we got another saddle, some more moss stone. Iron, just a bunch of random stuff in here, and another name tag. So maybe this episode we can go find a beautiful and fantastical horse. I want to ride a horsey. Horsies are so cool. Uh, anything in this one? No. Okay. Let's go grab some beef, and I'll go show you that mine I have. Uh, any beef? 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 No beef? Ah, oh, twenty-one beef. Let's go. Um, do I have any coal? Oh, sweet. And I also need to cook up some iron, to be honest with you guys. Uh, 33 iron, that'll be good. Coal, too. Boop. Boop. Okay. So, down here, guys, uh, I also cleared out a forest, which is over there, for some wood. Oh, let's actually do a level 30 pick enchantment. Alright, I know it's an iron pick, guys, don't worry. But one good thing about enchanting an iron pick is you're more likely to get some cool enchantments. So, here we go, guys. Ah, jump. Yeah. Okay. Can I get in the door, please? Thank you. 30 levels on an iron pick. Um, episode 4, let's go four times. 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, baby. I mean, just just look at, just bask in its glory. Bask in the glory of the iron beautiful pickaxe. Still touch 1, efficiency 4, and breaking 3. Wowzers. What an iron pick. I'm, I'm going to start enchanting those guys. They have done nothing but awesomeness to me. Six steak, five iron. Okay, sweet. You know what? This, this. Oh, and here's my chest of the first block broken. I'm just going to put that guy in there because he's so special. Uh, let's throw some stuff around. Um, haven't gotten too organized. Going to need those guys. Um, throw all the stuff I don't need. I'm going to need those bookshelves. So, oh, you know what? You're hopefully, hopefully, guys, I can mine. <laughs> I mean, this is a huge help. I just... Oh! Woohoo! Yay! I can mine these in my silk touch pick. Thank God, I don't have to waste any more wood. Woohoo! Yay! Look at these. Just... He's already doing work for me. Such a, such a nice guy, this silk touch pick. I'm gonna name him. You know, we, sh we should name him. I don't have five levels, though, so we can. <laughs> it's very, very sad. Let's grab all these guys. Um... And also, I want to make some more bookshelves because we're going to need more than this. We're going to need, I think, six more. So I don't think I have um, 18 leather, but I'm going to go kill some cows around the place and maybe we can get some more. All right, let's see. Do we have any leather? Come on, baby. Ah. Mm, four leather. Um, nothing else. Darn it. 
Let's take some sugar cane with us. We'll go grab some on our way back. Sorry if I'm boring you guys. Um, let's grab some beef. Okay, thank you. And let's go check out that shaft mine. So over here is... Oh, what am I doing? Get out. Whoops. Jeez, man, this pick is a maniac. Uh, let's just... Yeah, that's good. All right, so in here. So guys, down here, I didn't get too lucky with my shaft mine. I only got four diamond. And I enchanted that beautiful sword, sharpness four, looting three sword, and a uh, diamond shovel. So I still have one diamond left, only diamond to my name. Ah, man, I'm still discouraged about how dumb I was. I just, I went AFK for like 10 minutes and I decided to leave it on, which was not smart, in this not smart area. Just like out in the open and a zombie just kicked my butt. All right, so didn't go too far in this direction, saw that lava pool, went pretty far in that direction, and I decided to go down this way. Uh, I probably should explore this cave or please don't die let's just i i don't want to bore you guys with any caving this episode i don't want to do any of that but let's just see um if there's any diamonds uh any diamonds diamonds come out come out wherever you are come on come on oh, oh, die like a boss um there's some gold I'll come back and mine this later. I just want to see if there's any diamonds. We can roll out with our new Silk Touch pick and use the, use it on those diamonds, but there's none. So I'm not going to be able to do that. Let's go over here, and I'll show you the rest of this. Um, and then we're going to start building, because I know this is pretty boring stuff. And down that didn't do too much, but I found my diamonds right here. That was a fail. I was trying to do it for like 10 minutes. But guys, um, I'm going to go back and I'm going to get ready, get all my materials ready. We're going to do some redstoning, bookshelves, magicalness. So I'll be back with you guys then. Alrighty guys, so let's get to work. Okay, so first off, we're going to need to place our bookshelves around the place. Now, I want to get the maximum level 30, so I'm going to place them on the bottom row first. But I will show you where they're supposed to go later. And we need to place a stone brick there. No stone bricks? No stone brick for me? Uh, uh none? No! <laughs> Whatever, we can make some. Uh, yeah, that's all we're going to need. Four stone should be enough. Is this stone brick over here, too? Oh, no, it's not. Silly boy. You're supposed to be stone brick. Okay, so let's place it around the guy. Uh, oh, darn it. That was it. That was correct. Like so. Perfection. Bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. So we're only missing one bookshelf. The, the missing bookshelf. The missing bookshelf. Okay. We're going to need some more stone bricks so we can make some more. Perfect. All right. So we're going to need to place our levers first. So, boop. That's where our level goes there. Or our lever. I can't talk. I can't talk, man. Okay. So uh, we're going to need stone bricks all along this wall because when we lower the bookshelves and or hire them if they're on the top we're gonna need ooh let's place our enchantment table let's do a 360 place like a boss um let's actually make some more stone bricks we'll make 16 should be good all right perfect okay well off camera guys um uh on my leak actually I've been trying to gather some potion materials, but that has been flawed. I mean, it's really hard to gather potion materials just because of the fact that they're so annoying to get. Like, I was trying to find some gas in the nether, and I swear, there was none. There was absolutely none. And it seems like whenever I'm looking for a gas, there's, they're nowhere to be found, you know. But when I'm not looking for them, like when, I, when I'm just in the nether, just chilling, you know, don't don't want anything to do with them, they just they just pop out of nowhere. It's like, come on, just just... just Work with me, but I don't, I don't think they want to. They're they're meanies. Um, ah, oh, darn it. We're gonna have to silk touch all of these guys again. No. All right. Well, as I was saying, so I was trying to gather some gas tiers, and I only got two, which was a pretty big bummer for me. Dang, this guy mines pretty instantly. Pretty good. I mean, I, I don't know about you guys, but I think that's pretty good. Oh, whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Bam, we can take this guy out. Okay, so I only got two gas tiers from my expedition. I mean, I, I was trying really hard, guys. I was trying really hard, and I just wasn't working out for me. So, 
kind of a bummer, but what are you gonna do? Uh, cobblestone here and a sticky piston all along here. Um, oh, we need to soap touch your face. Gotcha. Alright, we can break these guys that's where the other pistons are gonna go. Okay, so we can place the bookshelves all along here so the nice wood texture will go around this thing. It'll look pretty smexy. Hopefully, I mean, if I'm lucky, you know. With my luck, probably not, but hopefully it will. Perfect. Okay, so we need to silk touch these other guys. Um, let's silk touch these dudes. And so an, I've got a bunch of stock of Insta Health Potions though on the Mind Leak server, so pretty good. And another thing about the Mind Leak server is I do have something else. I have something awesome. Just kidding. Uh, people have been using my potion shop though, so pretty good news. They said they've been liking it and they've been leaving some donations, so really cool there. Really cool guys on the Mind League server, I gotta admit. They're just like awesome people. Awesome people. Uh, we can place our bookshelves up here. Yeah. Let's actually just leave it for now. But another thing is Oblivious is going to be opening a new shop. And same with Eat Your Yellow. I mean, if you don't know who he is, I haven't seen him much on the server. But he's actually on, I just miss him most of the time. He's been on a lot lately, though. And he is going to be building a new shop, not sure. But I saw the layout, and it looks pretty darn cool. So hopefully he'll be building that soon. I'm not sure what his shop's going to be or what anything it is about. But it looks cool, so that's all that counts, right? Yep. Okay, so let's lay our bookshelves along here once more. And that's almost good. We need to break this guy. Sweet. And our last piston right here. Boop. Perfect. So these guys will look floating when um, those pistons aren't there. So kind of a bummer, but what are you going to do? I also enchanted a level 30 axe, and I got freaking um, fortune 3. I mean, I, I don't even know why they have that on an axe. Like, they were just trying to... They needed something, they needed an enchantment, and they just threw in crap one. Like, silk touch, I can understand. You get leaves, like, right? But, I mean, seriously, this... This, um... What's it called? Um, so we need to place our pistons here. Yeah. Well, darn it. Ah, oh, darn it again. Double darn it. Um, stone brick there. Perfect. And bam, bada bing, bada boom, boom, boom. Three bookshelves. Oh, wait, no. Two bookshelves. Like a so. Woohoo! Alrighty, so let's do the same thing on the other side. So, as I was saying, Oblivious is going to be opening up a new shop, which is going to be a really cool one. And I'm going to be shopping at a lot, actually, because I'm a lazy guy, you know. You know me. Uh, did I just waste a piston? Sure did. Let's grab you. Um, bam, bada, bing. Uh, yep. Looks good. So we can place our slab back here because we're not going to need it. Bam. Perfect. Um, one more up. So he's going to be selling enchanted books. And I think he is doing the community a favor. Stealthy Jacker does have a uh, enchanted book place. That he does have, and um, I think it's pretty good, but he doesn't really stay active on it is the only problem. So if I were to give him a suggestion, just be active on his place. So, and also, he, I looked at his supply, and it was just absolutely astonishing. The supply was crazy awesome, so really excited for that to open up. And so, I've had some customers at my shop, shop Rooney. And they have liked it. They left me some donations. Three nether quartz, but, or I mean, three nether quartz. <laughs> A stack of nether quartz ore. So hopefully that can be like my little XP grinder. If I need some love, ever levels, I can just mine that stuff out a little bit. Uh, so lever there, lever there, and a lever there. So, ooh, we need to place up little guy right here. Perfect. Okay. Okie dokie. So, um, that's really, oh, what are you doing under there, boy? There you go. Thank you. Okay, so let's wire this stuff up. Pretty simple wiring. Um, I just want to see if that powers it, just to make sure. Um, let's see. Just flip that guy. So um, I've had some customers, and they left me a stack of nether quartz ore, but it seems to have disappeared, so I don't know if someone's just doing something to me 
or if they decided not, they were like, man, this guy's shop's cool, and then they're like, no, this guy's shop sucks. So, I don't know, not, what the heck? Uh, I see, I see what the problem is, guys. Don't yell at me like, how do you not see that? I, I, I see it, I see it, don't, don't, don't you worry. There we go, so we need to do a cross like that, and perfect. All right, so now they'll go down on this side. Um, let's bring it down over here. So we need to bring them down. Whoops. Derp, derp, derp. Redstone across here. Um, let's place a block here. Bam. So let's go check that out, see if it works. Uh, it does, but we need to wire that guy up. Forgot about him. He's a loner. He's like, I want to be with my friends. But I'll let you be with your friends, buddy. There you go. You're a big boy now. Okay, so... That wires up, looks pretty good. So the rest of them will power that. I'm gonna just bring it across here. And actually this is probably a better way to, oh wait, no, never mind. Never mind, never mind. I never said anything. Okay, up like this. And we can bring it across like a so. No block there, what are you doing? There we go. Bam, 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 bam. And then we bring it down here. Uh. Okay, pistons, so we just do a little bit of that action. Boom, boom, boom. We got two rows of pistons in the bag. Let's check them out. Let's see. All right. That's beautiful. This is just absolutely beautiful. And do we get level 30 from that? Um, what can I throw in here? Um, I don't have any tools that are... Oh, actually, I only get level 22. But once we wire these guys up, we'll be getting some level 30 bookshelves in. I don't want this to just be my main, or this, I mean, this is going to be my main enchantment place, but I don't want it to be the only one, just because of the fact that um, I'm usually down at my grinder doing my enchants, so I kind of want to have a bookshelf area down there, just to make it a little bit easier on myself. Um, can we reach in there, flip that lever? Yeah, okay, sweet. So, that's the only reason I would want another one down there. Okay, so. And that grinder is absolutely working out fantastical for me. Um, and I love how it looks, too. I was pretty proud of myself. I was like, that looks pretty cool. I mean, oh, man. Jeez. I want some feather falling boots. I mean, that's probably next on my list to get some pretty... Good armor, but uh, can I break that? No, but I will anyway because I'm special. Okay, there we go. Uh, guess I don't. Yeah, okay. That looks pretty darn good. All right, so this lever, uh, can I do it? Can I do it? Oh, wait, I, no, 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 no. I saw it. You guys are gonna, I was going to be like, what? Why isn't this working? But I saw it. I saw it. Uh, can we reach it? Can we do it? Ugh. Get up. Um. Oh, well, fail. Derp. Okay, let's go back in here. And this is our almost finished. I mean, this is just one guy is a pain. He just wants to be a pain. It's meanie. Ugh. But so when it when it goes down, like all the stuff is down, um, there's supposed to be a piece of wood here, but do not mind that. Just little pumpkins in the places. I think it looks pretty decent. Uh, I might switch it to glowstone once I have a bigger supply, but I think it'll work for right now. And also, guys, um, I want to show you a little something, so I want to remove... Dang it, I probably don't want to do that. Uh, let's just do it. We already did one. We got to do all of them now. So, if you guys can see, um, I'm not really getting the lighting from anywhere, but under the enchantment table, look at this thing. This pumpkin, like this, since this enchantment table is a transparent block, it doesn't block out the light, which is really good. The main source of my beautifulness of this enchantment room. So really nice contraption. Place a stone brick here, and that's about good. Yep. Okay. And we can just break through here. Bam. Perfect. Uh, break through here. Bam. Perfect. 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 So, also, guys, another thing on mine leak is I'm a pretty poor guy, so I need to do some shaft mining on there too. Uh, so, I think it adds a pretty good feel. Look at this place. Just walk in. Ooh, what am I need? No, I want that. I want that. And I want that. Uh, I forgot that. No, need to do some more wiring. Alright, so, 
Uh, where's our wiring? There it is. Hey, iron. Thank you. Um, okay, where is this? Oh, there it is. Boop. Perfect. We're all done now. Uh, yeah, I get there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a... I'm not going to place a door here. But do we have any fences around or another brick stairs? Nah, we don't. Of course we don't, but that's alright. So I think this place turned out pretty good. Just walking into here, a nice little feel. And I think that's going to be a beautiful enchantment room. I mean, it's looking stunning. But I, I don't want to leave you guys with this, with this bookshelf. So I'm going to go kill a couple of cows, get that bookshelf placed, and probably we'll end the episode there. So I'll see you guys, and I'll place this magical bookshelf of awesomeness once I have it. So I'll see you guys then. Okay, guys, so we're going to be making the boss bookshelf. Oh, we're going to need that many more pages. Got the leather. Here we go. Need two more leather. Bam, bada, bing, bada, boom, boom, boom. Okay, guys, here's the moment of truth. The awesome bookshelf of the amazingness. There we go. So, guys, a few things I want to talk about before I leave for this episode is sorry for a little bit of a boring episode. I know this one was a bit boring just because I did a little bit of a world tour, but I just I did this thing on camera, but it just derped. So, I hopefully this episode doesn't derp and I have to record it once again. So, hopefully it doesn't. And another thing I want to talk about, guys, is a 1.7 snapshot. So, that thing came out a couple of days ago. A lot of work has been discovered, and I want to let you guys know that the Mind League server and I am not going to be switching to the snapshot. The reason for that is it was not suggested, and as well as I just don't want to use it, just because of the fact it's a little unstable and some more biomes might come out soon, so that's another reason. Did I, did I, did I just hear someone? No, okay, good, good, good. And another thing, guys, is my gaming computer coming in soon pretty excited and another thing once more and the last thing I'm going to be talking about for today is the fact that I have 45 subscribers so I mean that's not big of a milestone but I'm really proud of myself so if you guys did enjoy the set wait this it's beautiful I mean just ah. so there we go our enchantment room completed Let's take a look at it from both angles. Do. Oh my god. It's just absolutely amazing. Oh, I can't handle it. I can't handle it. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. So, if you guys did enjoy this episode, please do remember to leave a like, comment, favorite, whatever you want. But I want to thank you guys for watching and tune in next time for another episode of my single player Let's Play series. And, guys, it will be soon coming out with another mind leak episode so i will see you guys next time